on live is on live <laughs> online exclusive time y'all winter white woods uh it reams of glistening icicles uh cedarwood bark and spice sandalwood you all sometime when we get into these outdoor tree scent these type of wintry woodsy scent they could all sometime run together and smell similar now with this one right here, I was on the hunt from 2020. Remember the snowy driftwood from that Snow Lodge collection? So 2021, when this one came out, I grabbed it thinking it was the same. And it's not. Look at the scent notes. They all are different. Now, I would say with the sparkling icicles, just think like a breath of fresh air or you travel to uh colorado and a ski lodge and you know when your breath hits that fresh air like outdoor fresh air like that the cedarwood bark is going to be that woodsy that tree branches cedarwood followed by this spice sandalwood so if you take our beloved sandalwood and you put her with a little bit of cinnamon nutmeg like quality it's going to bring you winter white woods and this is just what this candle is giving this candle is going to give you a bougie ski chalet for the weekend and i was never mad at it now i was one of these ones that played around with the scent that'll grab one or two um but being that i like masculine scents i always find that i would burn through them and wish i always had another so this chance around this time around um i took no chances now to put this in comparison to cedar suede this one is a little more barky a little more birchy almost like that birch you're going to find in uh vanilla birch okay and then you know we have our beloved the perfect winter that have that eucalyptus that mint and the pine needles see all combinations are going to give you something different but one thing they all have in common is those wintry powdery clovey little spicy little minty little eucalyptus with some woodsy it's all going to be a combination of some of those uh but back there in my bedroom that throw and projection it is a beautiful cashmere like intimate bedroom burn when you're winding down at night it gave it a solid eight with a medium to high on projection i mean it always did beautiful like I said, that's why I reach for it from time to time, even if it's not in the holiday season. Back here in the beauty room, um, although it's a scent I could see myself getting ready to, it would be more of that wind down when I've took my makeup off. Because of the spice in that sandalwood, because of that birchy tree branches, it's just giving me a little more intimate feeling. It's not giving me morning do my makeup, but more like winding down and back there. It was a 10. Like, I didn't really enjoy it the most back there. Where I enjoy it the most is what you all are watching on the open concept. This just put the beautiful uh, Monday Night Football Sunday lineup. Uh, probably going to be my college football championship type of scent. Because, again, it's one of these great ones that's going to give you a balance. It's going to be a nice unisex balance. So, it doesn't smell like it's over masculine. And it does not feel like it's you know too much on the girly side is just right only that i can tell y'all is take yourself into the mind of a very bougie person and think about that person on their colorado ski vacation um all i want for christmas is you type of setting and you would like this candle again if you're into those vanilla birches if you were into the perfect winter um I wouldn't say the original winter because that has a lot of clove. This is not going to give you a clovey presence. This is going to give you a sweet sandal wood that has been sprinkled with some cinnamon. So your spice lovers, this is not heavy on the spice. This is going to be a little more herbaceous, a little more woodsy with that luxury linen cashmere type of undertone. Okay? She's that girl. So all the bougie candle lovers... um. A lot of y'all, I think, got this one in your collection. But again, to me, in my opinion, is cedar suede adjacent not quite the same thing? Okay? And I'm going to see y'all on the next review. Bye.